the hero just went ahead, huh? <laughs> Hey. That stupid dog. What are you doing? Holding my sword over lava. Oh. Give it back here, boy. Monster Hunter Ed. I think there's a new DLC coming out or something. Ah! Yes. My bird friend. That was close. Too close. Wait. This thing almost destroyed my sword. That would have been a catastrophe. He's evil. Literally. You promised not to kill them. No, Audrey. Don't you see? He's scared. He doesn't want you to hurt him. That's why he tried to take your sword. But he didn't hurt us. Didn't hurt us? He buried us under a rock slide. How the fuck are you <laughs> He's a big dog. We're lucky we escaped alive. Your bird friend has the right idea. The beast hurt them too, didn't he? This isn't what you promised. Literally, it isn't. I still hate her. You have to be nice. Let me just sing. We have to try, Audrey. I think there's still something good inside him. That doesn't look good. That thing's just a monster now. It won't listen to us. No! There has to be a way. There might be. If... You let me hit it with lightning. No! You want us to push you back into the fucking hole again? The hide him given that to random people. Um... He can eat them all. I think you deserve it. That'll stun it. And then you'd be able to get close. Oh, okay. Will that hurt him? Yes. Uh... Fine. But... Only because I want to help him. Okay, we're just stunning him. Please don't do more than you have to. Hey! Could you make yourself useful? And maybe cover me? I can't charge up if he's attacking me. Well, how am I supposed to... Oh, cover. Wait, what? Oh my god, I was about to fall. Oh, I see. There are arrows.
that work? I don't think it worked. Wait, what? How do I... How do I get rid of that? <laughs> oh... Wait, I don't know how to get rid of that... That pillar thing. I don't know if this is working. Oh. Bounces. Oh my gosh. getting smaller though. Oh. Stop moving! <laughs> I'm trying to get there. block that soon. You're the king of hearts, right? I bet nobody even tried to talk to you. But you're not really so bad, are you? I fucking knew it. Audrey? You... You promised. Yeah, well... I lied. But why? 
The King of Hearts was... We got him to Tiny Small so we could listen to... He didn't have to die. You just don't get it. And maybe you never will. This is just how it had to happen. And I did what I had to... To make sure it did. I told you. I can't just promise away my responsibility. <laughs> Should've left her in the fucking caves. Being the hero is more than that. Then being the hero is stupid. It's stupid and I hate it. It's stupid and I hate it and... You didn't have to do it. You could have chosen different. You could have healed the overseer. And fixed everything. And stopped the world from ending. But you ruined it. You ruined everything. Sorry. Oh. Little B. No. How you doing? Leave me alone. I don't want to talk to you. Ever again. What? You're a liar. This is just a game to you. You don't really care about us at all. You don't care if the world ends. You don't care about anything. I thought I could be a hero. I thought I could change something. But it was all a lie. It'd make me feel good. I should never have listened to you. Will be... That... Hurts. But it's not true. I really didn't lie to you. I swear. Actually, I came to tell you. I'm totally on your team now. I don't trust her either. <laughs> huh? Yeah. I mean, you're still definitely not the hero. That doesn't matter. You're good. And there's still a chance to stop the end of the world. There's still one more overseer. The one we, um, skipped. The Dream King? Yeah. I told Audrey as much. That maybe she should stop. And give you time to collect the Earth Song. Did you really? Because I don't trust anyone right now. But she really didn't like that. One bit. Really? I think she's really scared, little V. When I said she should wait for you. She acted like I was taking something from her. I think she really wants to be the hero. Basically, no matter what. Even if it means ending the world. He's kind of dangerous. Oh my god, she's the final boss. I mean, I love you both, but... She's gotta be stopped. Ah! Then there's no time to waste. Yes. We need to hurry. Back to Langtree. Right. But first... You gotta collect the King of Hearts song. Right. Oh boy, okay. Okay, I add them to... Okay. Also, what recipe is it, Ugly?
Mushrooms are so good though. I'll eat mushrooms with you, Rock Lee. X7. The Song in the Storm. The end times already. I gotta go. I gotta hoey. Is your grandma okay? She's fine. I gotta say my goodbyes to her. Figured I'd see you here. Just one more overseer, right? Right. It was so scary without you, Miriam. I met the hero again. And I thought we'd be friends, actually. But she didn't want that. Yeah, no crap. But she also told me some things. She's not evil, Miriam. She's just misunderstood. Yeah, but what she's doing isn't right either. <laughs> Coming from you, I think that means the same thing. I don't even care about her. I came to see you. I'm sorry I left. I couldn't let you do this part on your own. Oh, Miriam. This isn't a joke. This is really it, love. We're gonna have to face a dream king. Probably miss Hero too. If she kills him, it's all over. The world is actually gonna end. And everything we worked for, and all the places we've been, all the people we know, they're gonna go away. Do you understand that? Yeah. I'm scared, Miriam. But we'll just have to do our best. I'm glad I'm doing it with you. You... Okay. Let's go. Flee to Delphi. Oh yeah! That's how our adventure started. Feels like forever ago. It does feel like forever ago. <laughs> also, what happened to the house is... Bardlet. Oh goodness, I didn't think I'd ever see you again. Marley and I miss you so much. It's certainly been a time here. It's as the spirits warned us, I suppose. I can't believe it's the end. Oh, hold on. I'm gonna save everyone. These tendrils are. Oh, okay. Oh, I see. Now 
No. Dang it. Miriam, why can't we just get on your room? I guess I go up. Wait, I think I need that bird. Need it the whole way. Okay. It's... it's a mess here. Wait, they're here. Oh boy. You again. In a time like this. What is it with these humans? Waiting until the worst possible moment to show up. Stuff's about to go down. Big stuff. The Dream King's fading. And once he's gone... Oof. The whole world's over. You sure you want to be here for it? You should go hold someone you love. Or something. Bark. The King of Hearts didn't make it back after all. Ah, I'm sorry. I really tried. That's okay. Losing your overseer is part of being a fairy. Even though it's sad. I knew to expect it. Talking to everyone here made me feel a lot better. I know it's gonna be okay. I'm still sorry. But I'm glad you're okay. Everyone else is here? Oh my goodness. You've come for the end too, hmm? It's a bit like a farty here. So fun. I love farties. Uh, a great farty. <laughs> Meow had a feeling you'd be here again. Because of my determination. Something like that. Mr. Dream King has only gotten worse. He spent a lot of time away. Avoiding the hero. But he can't do that anymore. He's really sick. Meow is worried he doesn't... Ooh, excuse me. I have much longer. Good thing we made it just in time. I'll sing to him. I've been all over the world now. I have every piece of the Earth song. Except his. So it's totally different from last time. This time, he has to listen. Meow isn't so sure about that. But you don't care what Meow thinks, do you? Nope. Sheesh. Is he up here? Oh. Oi. What's up? Thanks for busting me and Mooney out of the spirit world. We had a bunch of cool adventures together here. I'm glad. <gasps> oh, it's you. Talking to everyone here is so scary. Everyone's overseers are gone. I miss the moon's queen, but at least I have Sunny.
Oh gosh. You don't look so good. I don't feel so good, Mr. Sark. Mr. Drinking. Oh. How, uh, how you doing? Fantastic. Definitely not deteriorating at an alarming rate. Still got my winning personality and charm. See? Mr. Drinking. You really gotta talk. Oh boy, great. The hero's on her way here right now. And you're the very last overseer. If she kills you, that's the end of the world. Oh, wow, really? Thanks, didn't know that. Ugh, enough with this ass. We need the Earth Song from you. Before you're dead. Give love the last piece now. Okay, sure. You will? No. You know what almost makes me sad? Realizing you will never get it. Because you won't give it. I don't mean the Earth Song. I mean... It. You travel all over the world now. You must have seen yourself. Everything is falling apart. Everyone's losing hope. Those aren't just signs of the end coming. That's what the end is. It's inevitable. Collecting song pieces doesn't matter. And clinging onto the Earth song is some kind of easy answer. It wasn't easy. We did a lot of stuff to get here. <laughs> For all our problems. That's what's sad. This world it was over before he even started. That's it? You wanna just give up? On the Earth song? It's impossible. Everyone and everything are moving apart. Always have been. Ever since the universe started. Expanding, decaying. The whole world could still act together as one. The end wouldn't have come in the first place. Look, I don't want it to be over either. I did everything I could to delay it. I broke the rules, but that made everything worse. The world outside turned ugly while I stalled. People are suffering. Making the world go on longer just isn't natural. You need to let go of it. Whoa! That was easy. That's the end then, right? Credits roll. Thanks for playing. You. Can't believe you did that, Audrey. Quit acting so surprised. You both did a great job getting in my way at every step. But in the long run, it, in the long run, it was pointless. I win. You losers never set a chance. Feels good, to be honest. I almost wish it wasn't this easy. Ayala told me about what happened between you. She didn't lie to you, did she? She believed in us. If she had just waited, we could have saved the Dream King. She told you that, huh? Okay, it's true. In the end, even Ayala turned on me. That's because you're the bad... That's why I ditched her. Because she was wrong. And if you never understand that, it doesn't matter. It's over. Oh crap. Is it happening? Wait, no, that's him. Oh, he has a health bar. <laughs> Yeah, this. No. Now that's more like it. A real final boss. You're insane. That means we still have a chance. We have to stop her from killing the Dream King. I know that. One last chance. You, me, and a giant evil boss monster. Against one lone hero. Pretty good odds, right? 
You gotta protect him? What's happening here? Ah, this is stupid. Can't protect the Dream King forever. Eventually, she's just gonna win. What do we do? Mm. Steal her sword. She can't do anything without it. Steal her sword? That's ridiculous. But okay. You focus on distracting her. I'll go for the sword. Okay. Hey, girly, let's go. Ow! Oh, I, th I think I had to... There. Ah! I gotta direct these to her. Stop that. <laughs> There 
go. Ah! Oh. Don't move. You. Audrey. You losers. Ruining everything. And I actually mean ruining everything. This is my quest. This is my story. Everything that exists is at stake. How dare you try to take that for yourself? How dare you? Try to make it about... That's not why we did this. But okay. Try to make it about you. It isn't. Audrey. You're special. What? <laughs> Miriam's face is like, what the fuck are you talking about? I said you're special. Even if you weren't the hero, I mean. Audrey, you're super strong and super smart and really great at everything you do. I get why you were picked to be the hero. You deserve it, but that doesn't mean you have to do it. Being the hero is just a title. You can do whatever you want and you'd still be special. I really mean it. Let's stop fighting. You just give up on doing it your way. Maybe you wouldn't be the hero. But I could learn the Earth Song from the Dream King. And stop the world from ending. We could actually save the world. Everyone would be okay. And you'd be a real hero. Okay? That's not enough. It- She'd rather have the earth explode. I guess. Well, is the whole earth gonna start singing? I think that's what's gonna happen here. Granny and the Yetis are singing too.
But they're on the vote. The mermaids are on the vote. Grandma and Santa? I think it's our old band here. Ian. The bugs are singing. Ghost mom's here too.
Poor little whale friends. <laughs> or dolphin friends, I guess? They're too small to be whales. Oh my goodness, Miriam's a friend. <laughs> Oh my gosh. I'm so, 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 so proud of you two. We did it, right? Did we do it? I thought it was over. We never got the last piece of the Earth Song. I thought so too. But in the end, it didn't matter. <laughs> when you reached out with your voice, the whole world answered back. And Aya heard you. She saw you all working together. Just for a moment. And it was just enough. To harmonize with her new song. What you sang wasn't the earth song. It was something special. That only you could have done. And even after an infinite infinities. Of universes beginning and ending and beginning again. I've never seen anything like it. That's why I'm so proud of you two. Nobody ever tried like you did. It wasn't even supposed to be possible. Yeah, she was no help. <laughs> but you made it possible. You changed the rules forever. You gave hope to everything that exists. And that's just so special. What's happening? Oh, <gasps> wait, what about Audrey? I guess. <laughs> Fuck her, I guess. Wait, maybe we'll see what happens with all the other people. <gasps> the fairies turn the overseers. I think this is what's happening. That's so cute. The Queen of Hearts. Oh, we can talk. Never thought I'd see the day. But peace talks are finally happening between Chandesh and Rule. Only Hollow are still here to see it. It feels so bizarre sitting here and talking to the Witch Queen like she's just another person. We spent our whole lives afraid of you. Get over it. I'm not going to live forever. You don't have time for distrust. I need to know my people will have peace after I'm gone. It's you. I promised myself if I ever saw you again, I'd capture you and put you back in prison. But now we're in peace negotiations, so your counts of treason are currently suspended. I suppose. Boss, you made it back. You were keeping Chandesh safe while you were away. It was tough. The monsters just got worse and worse. 
Tough for regular old witches, maybe. But not for us. No, it really was tough, though. Yeah, I guess it was pretty tough. But then, all at once, they just vanished. It was a miracle. They probably gave up after we fought them so hard. I think our singing did something, but... Well, we're here. You said you want to check in on your friends, right? So let me know when you're ready to move on. <gasps> yes. Let's check in on our friends. Hola, looks like we have a special guest in the audience. Now that the borders are open again, we've hit the road. Or the river, with my boat. We're a sailing band. Like pirates? Not really. But look, I even got a new accordion. You still remember your song too. That's right. Do you like to hear it? Yes. I wrote this song. Haha, <laughs> let's go. Oh, they're gonna play it. I'm not smashing my accordion this time. It's really expensive. <laughs> they played my song for me again. <gasps> Cookie lady. Hello again. Did my flower come in handy? You said it was to save the world or something, didn't you? The world's still here, so it must have worked. Ho ho ho. Yeah. Okay. More friends. Yes. Froggy. So regal. I love. Doo hoo hoo. It's my buffin. Are you finally moving back in with Mama? No. What a shame. <laughs> Yaha, you came back. Me and Doggy are doing so great. You named it Doggy? We never would have come together without you. Thank you so much. I mean it. She taught me a lot about myself. Nobody in this town ever believed in me before you. But now it feels like everyone does. Oh, that's cute actually. I've got a new job now. I'll never have to wear that cruddy, happy kid mask again. I'm finally putting my science degree to use. The factory is alive now, have you heard? We're developing stuff that's gonna change the world. Interesting. We've returned. We've been toiling away here. After our quest to destroy the factory, we had to create something to replace it. Miss Astronomer, that is, Elara. He has such a grand vision for this city. I couldn't help but be taken up by it. Does a lab now? Oh. Ah, my old cohort. How do you do? With the Baron stepping down from the factory. I've seized the means of toy production. Yes. And I repurposed it to be my new laboratory. There's so much machinery in here with so much potential. You could use it to manufacture new technologies. To the benefit of everyone. That's my vision for this place. I ain't holding up. I can't talk to him. <laughs> I wish I could talk to Sandy Claus, but I can't. <laughs> he looks so normal. <laughs>
Matey, it's been so long. Have you been adventuring? We've been on some of our own. The memories joined our crew now. You sound better than ever, matey. You've got to sing with us again soon. Youngin, made it back in one piece, huh? I was worried. Didn't think he had it in me. Kids like you don't go far in this world. What does that mean? <laughs> At least I thought so. Bet you've seen some things now. Maybe you're crusty as old Lou now, heh. No, you definitely ain't. The bard of 500 beans is back. Business has been going well. All these bozos have been worrying about mermaids. I've been keeping our bean flow strong. Money isn't gonna make itself. I mean, I haven't been all business. But, mostly. Why, if it isn't the silly one? Back for more, huh? Just kidding. The truth is, this whole crew is as silly as they come. I've been fooling myself denying the obvious truth. It's good to have you back. I can't talk to the mermaids? Where's my girl? Here she is. Heh, <laughs> the cool kid's back. Look up at the sky. Isn't it pretty? Stars have been falling all day. Never seen something like it. Feels like today is really special somehow. Woo! Me and my girls are taking over this ship. No more hiding out on secret islands for us. We're adventurers now. It's pretty great. I'm glad y'all are having fun. Yes. <laughs> and big lips. It is a mermaid fish? Hold on. <laughs> I can't believe Delphi's still here. When we left, it really seemed like it was over for this place. I'm glad. Ace. Who knew we'd find each other again in Delphi? We didn't think we'd ever be back here. And you neither. But a miracle's happened. Delphi's shining brighter than ever. We're back from an adventure around the world. It feels like the spirit is back. We're gonna play some shows here they never forget. Feels good to be back in Delphi. The same class as Dump as before. I've gone through a transformation. I played my heart out on the world stage. I've soared like an eagle. Being here reminds me of how far I've come. Cute. Cute. I went through the credits already. It just says thank you for playing. Like a Pokemon. <laughs> <gasps> oh, it's so good to see you. Miriam told me so much about you. She did? Oh my, yes. She cares about you so much. You made her feel a kind of warmth she never had before. She might never tell you that, but it meant so much to hear that from her. She's such a lonely girl, you know. Thank you for being there for her. Who else are you missing? What? You're leaving just like that, Miriam? After bringing your friend all this way? That simply won't do. Ask if they'd like to stay for dinner. You wanna stay and have dinner with us? That sounds nice. <laughs> oh, the kitty. <laughs> Look at him! Look at her. She's Grace. Mm -hmm. 
so it says goodbye, huh? Just for now. We're gonna hang out all the time, right? I hope so. <gasps> Hug! Yes! I'm tired. Me too. Came a really long way together, didn't we? Yeah. Thanks for saving the world with me. Yeah. Thanks for being my friend. Okay. Bye. Oh, that's me sleeping. to Audrey. Oh, wow. Like, literally scenes. And here's the boss battles too here. Dark chocolate. My tea rating. I'd say a 9 out of 10. It's pretty good. Intermission was the hero's part, it looks like. Interesting. Audrey died the end. I guess she did. I was like, we saved the world despite what she said, so I don't know what she did. So I guess I could go back for bonuses if I wanted to. What does this mark mean? Does it mean there's stuff I need? I could like find. Oh, they're seals. They're not dolphins. <laughs> Scene fifty, Audrey. Fuck you. <laughs> was very cute. Very good. I enjoyed that. Well, I was just gonna play till I finished this, so it took an hour. Which is what I expected. And stream. There won't be streams for a while because I'll be working at a new job. I don't know how that'll be schedule wise. Uh, so we'll see you next time. We'll we'll pick back up Monster Hunter. I promise. I'll finish it. I promise. Yeah, hope you guys have a good rest of your evening.